So close, no matter how far, we lost out to Atlanta. Goal difference was a step too far, and nothing else matters. Wait, hang on, we got the playoffs! Run the intro! Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Miju FM and this is Kill Em All. As you can see, we didn't win the league. We lost out on goal difference of all things. Um, since the last video, we had some bad results, some good results. We sort of lost form at the wrong time. Um, as you can see, we beat the Pharaoh in the last video. Then we had a really disappointing 1-0 away loss. Um, Another one of those games where we were on top, we just couldn't seem to score. Facundo Pons was having a nightmare. You can see he got like a 6.4 and then they scored in the 87th minute. Then I thought that might have just been a blip because we beat Estudiantes 2-0. We beat Belgrano 1-0. And then we had a disappointing 2-2 draw at home to Gimnasia, um, which again, we should be picking up those points. But we then beat All Boys before a cup game, which I... You know, moved a few players around. Salva, Roland, Moreira, uh, Fernandez, um, you know, Pavon. The players that hadn't played much, they played in this game because the, the days were, like, too close. Um, we had a big game on a Saturday. Uh, we lost that game 2-1 despite being in the lead. As you can see here, they scored two quick-fire goals, which was disappointing, but I wasn't overly worried because I wanted to rest them for the Deportivo Moron game, which... Didn't work anyway because they completely killed us. 3-1. Um, I thought we were going to get back into it. To salvage a point perhaps. But then they scored again. Um, and then San Martin again. In the league this time at home. Another disappointing 2-2 draw. But this time at least we salvaged something. As you can see here we were 2-0 down at home. Um, but then it came down to a big game against against Atlanta. I didn't show this really because Faro were top, Atlanta were second and then it was us. Um, and we were kind of off the pace. We drew 0-0 to Atlanta. If we had beaten them, we probably would have, well, we would have won the league. Um, as you can see here, Arias was sent off in the 55th minute, which literally killed the game because we were on top. And if he had stayed on the pitch, I'm sure we would have won that game. Um, and then the final game of the season, as I said, Faro and Atlanta were on top. Um, we actually won. Faro uh, lost and we ended up finishing joint top. But as I said, goal difference killed us. If we go to the National... Oops. Here. If we go and check... Oh, what am I doing? Clicking too fast. Sorry, guys. If we go to the uh, league here, you can see we had a goal difference of 12. They had 25. Um, so it was close in the end, but no cigar. Um, so then Atlanta played the Champions playoff, where they played the winners of the other group, which was Independiente Rivadavia. They won 2-0, so they have been promoted. Um, so we were that close to getting promotion. So Independiente are now into the playoff with us, the promotion playoffs. As you can see, there's a quarter, semi and a final. So we play Sarmiento from the other group. Faro play uh, Belgrano. Gimnasia play Tigre. Tigre. Um, and then Independiente come into it into the semi-finals. So yeah, there's a lot of games to go through. So we are going today give you two games. We're going to give you both games of the quarterfinals and hopefully we will get through and then we'll have another video potentially tomorrow of the semifinals. But we'll see. In the meantime, can I just say thanks for all your support. Um, but I'd love it if you like this video, if you would like to subscribe, leave comments, please do all of that because it does mean a lot to me. Um, I'm really trying to grow as a content creator. So all of your support and continued support 
is valuable. So, yeah, thank you. Um, so let's get into today's game. As you can see, we've got a few issues. We've got injuries and suspensions all over the shop. So we're not going to even be able to field our strongest lineup, but at least we are at home. So today's starting lineup is Champagne, Roland, Moreira, Lopez, Arias, Julio, Gianni, Mendes, Moreno, Pons, and Thiago. So let's go and hopefully be victorious. It's been a great save so far it's been fun but i really would love to get that promotion if we can but it's a lot it's a big ask because we've got a lot of games that we need to win for things to go in our favor um but it's not to say that we can't over two legs you know we can afford to lose or draw a game as long as we capitalize in the other leg um so hopefully we can do it so here we go Dressing room, pump fist. Uh, what do we say? We'll just we'll just go with that one. Pump fist. Pump fist. Some of the games as well, especially the ones that we were struggled in. I have played around with three at the back, so we might see that again in the playoffs if and when I need it. Um, for some reason, the two D aspect has. Oh no, it's still there. I don't know what happened there. That was weird. Okay, so here we go. Playoffs. Come on. Can we get the win today? If we can get a couple goal lead. Yes, there we go. Straight away. Two minutes in. Tiago, come on. Whoa. That was a brilliant start to the game. We don't need to see it. Let's just go. Let's get the win. Get out. Ne on to the next one. As I said, we will be bringing you both games in this um, video today. So hopefully we will, well, we will know the outcome by the end of today's video. Hopefully there'll be another one tomorrow with regards to the semi-final. Great defending there. Bit of a depleted squad. So there's a lot of pressure on a few players that haven't really been involved. But so far, we're doing all right, despite some into having more possession and more shots. <laughs> um, so now approaching 20 minutes. Can we continue? Oh, come on, guys. We've had a big injury as well to Daniel Bocanegra and since he came in, that's when our form picked up and we, that's put what put us back into contention. Losing him, I'm not saying what's the reason why our form dipped, but it was certainly a factor as to why we conceded like so many soft goals. Um, and with, with him out, our other defenders, especially Moreira and Lopez, they have like concentration issues. So hopefully... <clears throat> they can hold their nerve. But they're in now, Sarmiento. And there we go. It's 1-1. One, one. Not sure. I didn't actually check if away goals count. I'm assuming they would, with it being two legs. Um, but that's not what we wanted. Mendes now. Out to Coolio. Gianni. Pons is in. Oh, it's saved. And Thiago's got a second. The goalkeeper fumbled a couple of the shots there. And now we're back in the lead. Come on. As we see here, Pons had a shot. It was a good save, actually. Moreno came in. That was poor. Maybe it hit the post. But either way, it fell to Thiago, unmarked, to slot it home. Here we go. Thiago now. Julio. Gianni. Mendes. Out to Arias. Cross it in. Thiago. Oh, nearly there for the hat trick. <sighs> hate playoffs. I hate them. They're like, they're just, you can never tell what's going to happen. And also, with with these teams from the other league being involved, I don't really know the, their quality. Obviously, the fact that they finished in their playoffs says that they are um, decent. Great block again. Can we hold on now? Come on, ref. What are you doing? It's been two minutes. 
Cleared it away. Half time. Good start, boys. Good start. I'm going to say... I'm happy with that so far. They love that. Brilliant. But you can still improve. Come on. I think everyone looks at... Moreno is probably the only player. Oh, and Rolon not having the best of games. But at the same time, not really bad enough to be concerned about so far. Oh, I'd really like to have a couple goal lead for the next the next leg. Don't really want to go in with an away unknown away game. I don't really know how good they are at home. Should have done my research really. But so far, so good. Can we get another? Oh, so close there by Moreira, who's on a yellow now. We've only got youngsters on the bench as well. So to bring on if we need to bring on another defender Thiago now Gianni Mendes Gianni he's having a good game in that unfamiliar central midfield role Pons Facundo Pons I was an own goal I'm going to still credit Pons because he was the one that made the shot so 3-1 come on Pons finished I think on 19-20 goals in the regular season which for an on loan striker, <clears throat> it's really good. Great save there by Champagne. Champagne also has announced he wants to retire at the beginning of um, next month. I've asked him to reconsider, but he hasn't got back to me yet. Moreno now. 60 minutes gone. Let's demand more. Is there anything we can do to freshen things up? We have got a lot of yellow cards. I'll bring Moreno off for Acevedo. And I'll bring Arias off for Bindela. Because at least that's a couple of yellow cards off the pitch. But I'm a bit concerned about our defence. Especially if they stop piling the pressure on but Thiago now Acevedo with the shot and end of highlight can we get another one if we can go three goals to the good then we are in a perfect position and oh Thiago at the back post so close Coolio now and saved by Vicentini Come on, guys. Demand more. Don't let them in. Good save, Champagne. Come on. I'm a bit concerned about this defence. I'm really... Oh, both having a good game, though. What do we do? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to risk it. I'm going to bring on Barrientos. I just don't want a red card, because... We need the players for the next leg, and like I, ooh, like I said, we've got some suspensions and injuries currently, which do not help. Sarmiento now coming on strong, looking for one more to come back, and they've got it, but it's offside. Oh, my heart skipped a beat then. Don't need to see that again, thank you very much. Here we go now, final five, six, seven minutes. Can we win it back? Oh, oh wait. Roll on. Barrientos. Right. Might start. Oh no. I was going to say after this. Right. right. Okay. I'm going to do something I don't always do. But I'm literally going to just put my wingers. Uh, like play a 4 4 2. And then I'm going to go a bit cautious. Hopefully. That will help us see the game out. Mendes now. Out to Acevedo. Can we count, catch him on the counter? No. Last five minutes. Oh, coming on again. Good defending there. We have been brilliant at the back so far today. 
Can we hold on? No. Oh, brilliant save by Champagne. That might make all the difference going into the next game. Demand a bit more. Last few minutes of injury time. Oh, they're still coming strong. Cleared again. Can we get there? Oh, we did, but it gave it back. Another corner. Oh, my God. Get it away. Great play. Come on, now on the counter. Go on, Gianni. You're through. You're through. Gianni! What a goal! Come on! Get in! What a brilliant counter there. Look at Gianni. He picks it up and he just bombs forward. They could not catch him. And what a cool finish to seal the game. 4-1. Get in. Come on. Blow the whistle. Don't let them back in again now. Oh, they're in again. Ooh. Last minute. This game has been endless highlights. Champagne now. Barrientos has come on and has got a yellow card himself. Acevedo. Bindela. Acevedo. Thiago now. Can he beat his man? He doesn't need to. Final few seconds. Final few seconds. Final few seconds. Ref, what are you doing? Great defending there by Lopez. And there we go. 4-1 victory in the first leg. How about that? Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Right, guys. I'm going to skip forward a few days and be back with the second game in a second. So, see you then. Okay, guys. We are back for the second leg. Um, just a bit of admin beforehand. Champagne has decided to retire. And I've checked the rules for the second leg. And if the scores are level, it will actually be penalties. Away goals don't count. So um, we got a three goal lead anyway. So hopefully that will be enough. Um, so today's game, we've got a few guys back. Cuba and Allegre are back. So we're going to go with Champagne, Cuba, Allegre, Lopez, Arias, Julio, Gianni, Mendez, Moreno, Pons and Tiago up front. With Roland and Moreira moving to the bench. Um, hopefully we've done enough to get through. I don't want to go to penalties for sure. I hate penalties. Um, although we have got a few good takers. So I might have to save like maybe Pavon, that sub, if it's close towards the end, to maybe bring him on. But we will hopefully not need to get there. So let's say... Um, I want to point the finger and I want to say, don't let it undo us. It's not really gone too well. Well, they're motivated at least. So that's good. So let's go. Second game. Here we go. Can we get into the semis in today's video? It's a good start again there. 20 seconds in, we've had our first shot. Nothing happening so far. Arias now, Moreno, out to Cuba. I, put, I brought Cuba in for Roland, even though Roland did well in that previous game, just because Cuba's got a bit more defensively. But now they're in, and Vidaya puts it wide. The former Boca Juniors player had a great chance then. But Scuffed his lines. Here we go now. Corner to... to and we scored! Thiago again! The man for the playoffs. Sixth goal of the season at the back post. Moreno swings it in and there he is. Thiago just unmarked basically. Heads it home. That's put us 5-1 up. Even I can't mess this up surely. Here we go. Oh, good block there. Can we nick it back? Sorry for the sirens if you heard that. I live by a road and something is an emergency. Oh. Nearly 20 minutes coming up so far. I'm really happy with how we've performed. 
Mendes now. Kevin Mendes to Thiago again. Thiago again. Thiago. That's his fourth goal of the playoffs. He had only scored three before for me. So he's come up big when needed. Brilliant finish there. 2-0 on the day, 6-1 on aggregate. Pons. Mendes now. Mendes has been really disappointing since he's come in. I thought, when I looked at his attributes and when Congeli got like injured and retired, I thought Mendes was going to be the answer. But, he's, I mean, he's having a good game now, but he hasn't really done a whole lot since he's come in. Thiago. Coolio. Arias, Gianni, oh, Gianni's loving that central midfield role. Nothing comes of that corner. Demand a bit more. Still nervous and we're 6-1 up, it's ridiculous. It's been a long season. To lose it out on goal difference was disappointing, but... When you lose a game 6 0, kind of doesn't help, does it? Pons now. Pons hasn't really done much so far, although his rating suggests he's doing a bit more work off camera. But that's a good first half. Outstretched arms, keep it going, guys. Brilliant. Got faith in you. Fantastic. So let's see. Lopez is on a yellow card. Might actually make an early sub. Just because there's no point risking losing him for the next game. Unless he's suspended anyway and then he won't be there. But here we go. Corner. Cleared. Cuba. Julio back to Cuba. Gianni to Mendes. Moreno, Moreno with a Scortio. His fifth goal of the season. What a finish that was from Moreno. You've seen it before in previous videos. He's got the ability to just ping one from nowhere. Look at this. Bang. Keeper, no chance. 3 0. So far, so good. But could there be even more? Cuba to Gianni. Coolio. Gianni. Coolio. Mendes. Back to Cuba. Coolio. This is good play. Gianni. Moreno tries his luck again. Look at the stats that we've had as well. We've had 16 shots so far. Thiago's in again. He tries to square to Pons and Pons gets a goal. It's 20th of the season. What a great goal that was. Thiago does brilliantly there. First time finished by Pons to make it 4 0 and 8 1. You wouldn't think this was a playoff, would you? We've had 18 shots, 11 on target. Can we get a clean sheet? We don't seem to get them very often. Thiago now. Thiago with his hat trick. There we go. Fantastic, boys. I'm still going to ask for more. <laughs> the pawns returning the favour there for Thiago, who runs through to slot it home. What a scoreline so far. Corner. We're not... We're not giving up all, Moreira. We want more. Hopefully we won't use all our goal allocation before the semi-final. You can see Grillo there on a 5.9. We actually had him in on trial at the beginning of the save. Looks like we dodged a bullet there. So Thiago, going to save him, bring on Pavon. Oh, Allegre now is on a yellow card. We've got another centre-back. Unless we put, we're going to do this because I don't want Allegri to be sent off. 
bring on roll on there there we go the game's pretty much done and dusted so we can avoid risking him as he's our captain our main man corner to Sarmiento now can they get a consolation goal last 10 minutes approaching so I'm going to leave out a couple more minutes and I want to praise them because they have been fantastic Moreira roll on Coolio out to roll on again Moreira back to roll on Mendes Gianni Coolio brilliant build up play so far out to Cuba to Pons roll on picks it up blocked Coolio Mendes back out to roll on can he get the ball in he can and Pons is there what fantastic build up play Pons with his 21st goal of the season to make the, make it 6-0 and 10-1 on aggregate fantastic can't believe it guys I can't believe it where's the shout oops they dropped me mouse praise them for that can we keep a clean sheet would be lovely jubbly close Morera now to roll on Mendes poor ball and they're in for Dyer. great block there by roll on last five minutes nothing to worry about so far Morera Moreno Ooh. they're in <laughs> and there's there's the goal of course should probably have gone on to um, cautious but pff, let them have it guys it's 10-2 10, -2. 10 -2. final couple of seconds and that should be it. There we go. What a quarter final we have had over two legs. Fantastic. Tiago, what a. I don't know where what's happened to him. Like, he's barely scored since we brought him in in the summer. In the, January transfer window sorry but there we go so let's have a little look so we've got Tigra in the semi-final I think they might be a bit more challenging but Faro got through and they will play play Independiente so it's interesting because I think Wow, look at that. They went through 6-5. They won 4-1 away after losing the first leg. Tiger went through 4-2. So there we go, guys. That'll be it for today. We'll bring you the semi-final in the next video. I'm assuming it's a two-legged affair again. Yep, yeah, so we've got, we'll bring you the two semi-finals in the next um, video. But until then, as I've asked before, please like, subscribe, comment, interact. I love it all from you guys. Um, and it means a lot. So I hope you enjoyed this video and see you soon. 10-2. Come on.